Hey, what's going on everyone? Here's your man Jay, old school player video games here in Lexington, South Carolina. So you recently got back into retro gaming, mainly the Nintendo Entertainment System or the NES. But sometimes when you put games in, of course, you know, they don't play 100% all the time. A big cause of this is because your cartridge, the contacts on the inside are dirty. So an easy way to fix this or just simple Virtual Gaming 101 is you want to clean these contacts on the inside, but you don't want to use soap or water. What you want to use is alcohol, mainly rubbing alcohol as close to 100% alcohol as possible. The reason you use alcohol is because the alcohol evaporates and doesn't stay on the contacts. So after you clean it, you let it dry for a second, you can put it in your console and it should work unless something else needs to be cleaned. You know how those old school Nintendos are, you know? So what I've done here is I'm gonna be doing Super Mario, right? And I got my Q-tip. And what I did is I have rubbed my alcohol in this sprayer. So I sprayed the tip. This is the wet one, okay? And I rub it a little bit, just once over on a paper towel. This will get the excess alcohol off. And then what I'm doing is I'm going to rub across here. Okay, and what I'm doing is I'm rubbing up in the channel and then down across the contacts, right? And then after I do the other side, see, look at all that stuff already pulled off. Look at that. That's ridiculous. So what I'm going to do is, well, since this is so bad, I'm not going to stick that one back in there. I want to do the other side now and use the clean side to get the other side of the cartridge. So again... Let me do that so you can see it better. Okay. Not only am I cleaning the contacts, but I'm also cleaning the channel that the contacts sit in because a lot of times dirt uh, sits in there as well. And that can also get a bunch of gunk in your Nintendo uh, or Retron or whatever you're using. You know, regardless, you kind of want to keep these clean. Uh, believe it or not, the dust covers that the Nintendo games came with are pretty important, uh, but not necessary. Okay. Again, look at that. Look how gross that is. Okay, and then what I'll do is usually I'll just let it wave it a bit. You know, I don't blow in it, it's bad, because uh, your saliva curls the contacts. All right, and then what I'll do is I'll insert this in the NES and then, you know, fill around with it, put it in, hit reset, power on and off, maybe take it in and out a couple times, you know, if it's not working. And usually you know how you always have to fight with these things to get them work. That's just how it is. But a major cause of that is the contacts and the cartridge being dirty and all you need is alcohol and a Q-tip and it's an easy fix. This is Jay, old school player video games. Now also, side note, if you're a minor, you shouldn't be messing around with this alcohol. So you should really get your parents to do this, okay? Disclaimer. <laughs> Again, this is Jason with Old School Player Video Games here in Lexington, South Carolina. Come on by and uh, say hello. And as always, take it easy.